We drilled a 485 foot hole, threw a nuke into it, and then welded a steel plate on top, which itself is fairly indicative of how much we knew about nuclear weapons at the time. The point wasn't actually to make an earth gun, it was to test nukes safely. And the steel cap wasn't supposed to be a projectile, it was merely there to help contain the blast, which it did not. Instead, the explosion propelled it to an estimated speed of over 149,000 miles per hour and into folk legend status. It is thought that at the time it was the fastest man-made object, a spot that it would hold for many years until the Helios 2 spacecraft launched in 1976, almost 24 years later.